Hi guys, it's Delcy and welcome back to my channel. Um, this is like a new place I've like, haven't filmed like right here, like at my dresser yet, um, this year. Um, but that's because I've been at school and then other videos I've either been downstairs or just like in my bed. There was one video where I sat down like on the floor and did a video, like right in this spot, but I was on the floor, but yeah. So today's video is going to be a get ready with me for my first day of work. There's going to be another one coming of these in like about a week or so. Um, just because today for my job with Energy Express, today is just training when, um, and then the kids don't come until like the Monday after Father's Day weekend. So I uh, will probably be doing another video then um, about get me getting ready for like the first day. Um, me actually going to the classroom and having the kids um so i'm t kind of on like a little time crunch so like this video is going to be like not really, like really really fast but really quick so i have time to leave the place does like the place i have to go is like 23 25 minutes from my house so i don't really have to leave anytime soon it's 7 50 and uh, training starts at 9, so I'll probably leave about 8.15, 8.20, so I know I can get there on time and find a spot to park. So, um, like I said, today's video is going to be a get ready with me. Um, so yeah, so I'm just going to get started and then like ramble on and talk to you guys about like what I'm doing and then like other stuff. So, number one is I'm gonna put deodorant on. Um, after I put deodorant on, I'll show you what I'm wearing. So, I would have washed my hair this morning, but with the time I like woke up, I woke up at like 6.55, my alarm, well I woke up at 6.50 and my alarm doesn't go off until seven, like I'd set an alarm for seven because I knew I'd be able to get up, get ready. And like while I was getting ready, I knew I was gonna film this video, so. Like, I knew I'd have plenty of time, so I was just like, I just won't shower it. Like, it's fine. I'll shower later tonight and wash my hair, and everything will be okay. So, um, my outfit of the day is just this, um, Wesleyan shirt. It's the Wesleyan si uh, logo thing in the shape of West Virginia. And then I just have a pair of, uh, jeans on. Um, so, yeah. So, the first thing I'm gonna do is actually take... Um, I'm going to put chapstick on first, so, actually no. First thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take, like, my vitamins and stuff like that. So I'm going to, like, lay them out and then just describe what they are. Um, yeah. So, today, like I said, is my first day of, um, work with Energy Express. Um, I found out that, like, my last day won't be, will be July 20th. 7th, I think, is when, is what the email said, was that that would be the last day, which I thought it would honestly be longer, because it said 8 weeks, but, like, um, and, like, I kind of, like, did the math from when, like, the first, like, when the first, like, when the kids would first come, like, the first week that the kids were there, but I think they might have, like, added this week, like, next week, so I'm not sure sure why I'm ending that early, but I'll have a little bit longer to, um, get ready and do stuff for college, because, like, as soon as this thing is done, I'll have, like, a few weeks. I'm gonna say, I want to say it's, like, two or three weeks. I think it's two full weeks, and then, like, a weekend before I move in. Um, but also, I also thought that, that today was going to be, like, where I went and, um, set up my classroom. Um, because that's kind of like how they, people made it out to seem when I was, um, when I, like, went for training, like, when I went for the interview and everything, they are like, yeah, that Friday you're going to be sitting in the classroom, but, like, then they emailed us and was like, training's from 9 to 3 today, so I don't know if we're just going to go after training or if we're going to be going during training, so I'm just going to, like, bring my stuff with me. Um, everything isn't done, like, I have a few things that aren't done, but I'll be able to, like, um, if we're not going today, I'll be able to get them done, like, this weekend if we have nothing 
this weekend for training wise, which I don't believe we do. Um, but I'll be able to get that stuff done this week, this weekend. Um, so it'll be all good. And if not, if we set up our classrooms and like I don't have this stuff, then it'll be okay. I'll just like bring it with me that like first day or whenever we're able to go back to the classrooms and stuff like that. So, yeah. So today is just training, maybe setting up the classroom. I'm not too sure what's going on. So the first thing I'm going to take is just my doll um, because I started my period kind of like last night, but then it wasn't there. So then I like woke up this morning. I was like, okay, like I didn't start my period. Maybe it was just like a false one. But then I came back from breakfast and like I came back upstairs and I started. So I'm going to take this because usually like either it's the first day that I start my period or the day after I start my period that my cramps are really really bad and since I have training almost all not like all day but like from nine to three like I rather have this than nothing and be like not able to like do anything because like my cramps get like really really bad <laughs> maybe I'll do a video about that about like my cramp and period experience so maybe I'll do that so the next thing is this little um, brown looking thing and it's a pill for hair, skin, and nails and it helps you like, it's a dietary supplement and it like helps like your hair and your skin, it helps your hair and nails grow and helps your like skin get better I guess. So yeah, so I, um, I used to like have, like I took another type of brand of these pills, um, this is what the ones that I take, this is what the bottle looks like. Um, I used to take another version of that, but like that one, like I could not stand the, like the feeling of it like touching my mouth because like it didn't have like a coat around it so it honestly tasted like, like it didn't taste like it because I obviously don't know what dog food tastes like, but like the kind of like the smell and then like it in my mouth like it tasted like dog food. So next thing I'm going to do, the next thing I'm taking are these Sundown Naturals Vitamin C Gummies with Rose Hips and Bioflavonoids. It supports immune health and it's orange flavored and it's a vegetarian kind. Like I, I'm not a vegetarian, but you know, that, it's okay. And it's gluten free. So this is what the bottle is. Looks like I got that from Rite Aid. I don't know where the other bottle came from. My mom has it, so. Hmm. So the last kind of like pill slash gummy that I take is this airborne immune support supplement original helps your immune system uh, with vitamin C and nine vitamins and herbs. Um, it's another orange flavor it looks like this. I also got from Rite Aid. This they kind of do the same thing, um, but this one like they both have like their different like things that they have in them. So. I guess it's okay. Um, but yeah. So, I also got this from my, and these ones are like, a little bit more chewy. So, now what I'm going to do is, I'm going to get a hair tie because I don't want to put my hair back. Not that kind of hair. Okay, so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to brush my hair out. Because it's been curled for like, two days. I got my hair curled on Wednesday, and I think Wednesday was the day that I didn't film a video just because like by the time I got back like I was like doing schoolwork and stuff like that so I was just like I was I'm still kind of behind in like my schoolwork so right now I'm just gonna like brush it out and it's gonna like brush the curls out but honestly like that is fine because I like how it looks anyway like I kind of like this look I don't know why but like I I love the look that like curls have when you like are done having them look like curls and you just kind of brush them out like I'm still kind of like not used to my hair like I feel like that like every time like I get my hair done um because as you guys know like I had uh, blonde hair like I had like the root like the brown up at the top and then I also had um, 
And then I also had, um, just, and then the rest of it was just, like, lawn. So, like, um, it was kind of weird. But, like, a little, like, backstory of how, like, how many times I've, like, done my hair and, like, colored my hair. I never used to color my hair. Like, my hair used to be, like, kind of, like, a little bit lighter than this brown, but, like, still this brown color. Like, with no blonde in it. And then, um... And then I started doing blonde highlights, like, my sophomore year of high school, I think. And then I, um, I did my, um, and then my senior year I had, um, which was kind of, like, my senior year, my freshman year, which you guys saw, um, because that's when I started my channel. I had, like, blonde, it was, like, brown, blonde, and then red tips, I think you guys saw, yeah, you guys saw that, um, so that's that, I had that, and then my sophomore year of college, which was last year, I did just brown roots at the top, and then I kind of had blonde kind of like weaved in everywhere, but it looked like it was more blonde than it felt, like was actually there. Um, and then now it's just um, basically brown and blonde, but like in a different version, like the brown is like more out there, and I actually really like it. So, enough rambling because I still am on a time crunch and I feel like I just talk a lot. And this video is already, like, I feel like way too long. Sorry. But anyway, so now I'm going to use this Burt's Bees Vanilla Bean um, Chapstick while I'm getting everything else ready. Uh, yeah. So, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to use this on the spot acne treatment from Neutrogena. And recently, like, my forehead has been, like, very bumpy, so, like, I kind of, like, know that, like, it's, um, starting to get, um, become that season where little, like, pimples and other things come and attack my forehead, and it's mainly just, like, my forehead and my nose, so, like, I also will put it on my nose, and, yeah, so I, it's just easier for that and I usually don't use a lot of moisturizer at in the morning because I use moisturizer at night um but yeah so and then once this video is done I probably have to leave so I will not clean up my space like I will just clean it up later so next thing I'm gonna do is do my uh makeup and this is kind of like my everyday summer makeup routine even though I don't wear makeup like every day during summer but this is basically just what I do. So I'm just going to do the same thing because I don't wear a lot. So first I take concealer and just put some under my eyes. And then I use my beauty blender and I just kind of like blend it in like on like the top of my lid and then like underneath my eye. Um, like that's just what I do. Like... Like, nobody else probably does this, but I do this, and it kind of, like, I feel like it helps a lot, because it makes me look less of a, uh, rock hand. I usually do my makeup in the summer when, like, I have somewhere to go, but, like, I still kind of do the exact same thing. Um, most days I'll just put, like, if it's for, like, a nicer event, then I'll put, uh, like, eyeshadow on, but, like, if it's just, like, a normal day, um, like, I did my makeup yesterday for a meeting, and this is what I did. I didn't wear eyeshadow. And I'm not going to put eyeshadow on today because I rub my eyes a lot. So, like, unless, like, I've had a shower and I'm fully awake before I put makeup on, I will not put eyeshadow on. But I also don't, like, have a setting spray because I ran out of it and I just haven't had time to, or the money, really, to go, like, get it. So then what I do is I just take a little bit of this um, foundation and it's the CoverGirl Clean Foundation. It's the 125 Buff Beige. Um, it kind of, like, match, it doesn't really, like, match my concealer, like, because I don't know what shade that is, but, like, it's not this. So then, this, I just, like, kind of, like, dab it around my eyes, like, where I put the concealer, and I just, like, from, like, summer, I just mainly, like, make my eyes pop a little bit like that's the only reason why I like 
will put foundation on and it's just like around my eyes and then like I'll do my nose and then my chin and then kind of like the upper part of my forehead um yeah so that's really all I put it um but like I was saying like mine like the foundation doesn't really like match my um um can't think of the word my concealer at all like does not match it at all like in like my foundation makes my face feel like tanner like it make it look tanner than like I actually am um and uh yeah but like I have this um like the powder that I use kind of is like a is like a reflectant kind so like it just kind of it just goes based on what I have so if I was just to use like concealer one day like my face would look like based on like the concealer and then like if I had foundation it would make it look like that um yeah but fun little fact like I dab my like the stuff on my uh, forehead just because like my forehead usually especially during like school gets really really dry so yeah so the foundation I use is the original formula airspun one loose face powder um, I like this a lot. There was like a thing at the top of the th uh, container where it was like had the holes in it, but I took that out because like it just like wasn't working out very well for me and I don't know why, but now I just like take, put some on my brush and I just like put it in the lid and I like start out around in the lid and that's how I put my foundation on and I kind of just put it um, all over and like I said I like dab it on my forehead because like I get really dry skin especially like in like when I'm in school um, but like the dry skin is mainly on my forehead so if I try to like rub it like I do the rest of my face like it honestly would like get really really weird looking and so like I honestly would just hate it and end up just taking all the makeup off my face. Well, not my whole face, but, like, my, uh, forehead, and then just, like, doing that way, because it's just easier. So, next, what I'm going to do is I'm going to do highlight, and it's, um, I have, the brand I get, get it from is e.l.f., but honestly, like, all of my makeup honestly comes from Walmart, unless someone, like, gives me it, but, like, all of my, like, stuff from Walmart, like, all of my makeup and brushes are from Walmart. Like, that's weird to say, but, like, it's just, like, a lot cheaper, I feel like, at Walmart. And some of them, like, aren't even cheap at all. But, like, I feel like e.l.f. products at some places are, like, really, really cheap. But I got these brushes, and these brushes I think I got as a gift from someone, probably my grandma. And these ones I got at Walmart, because, um, I, like, there was, like, one time I was home, and I don't remember, like, when it was. But, like, I think it was, like, Christmas. And I, uh, um, I, like, forgot my brushes at school, and, like, I couldn't, like, go back and get them because, like, we were on a break. So, like, I think it was actually, yeah, I think it was, like, Christmas, and we were getting ready for, like, a Christmas party. And, like, I had no brushes. So, like, I really didn't do anything with my, like, makeup because I didn't, like, have anything. But what I do with this highlight is I usually just put it, like, on the top part of my forehead like kind of where I put the foundation um up cheeks like right here in both cheeks my chin and then I like put it on my nose um like it just gives everything up well. so next I'm going to put uh curl my eyelashes and um put mascara on and um I never like I like have this like near my like makeup mirror but most times like I don't really use it I only use it to see if like everything is like blended and good right and then I also only use it when I'm like curling my eyelashes because like when I'm home like I have a mirror as you could see I was like just staring straight I wasn't staring down but like I have a big mirror attached to my dresser so um like I was just using that the whole time um, but sometimes, like, curling my eyelashes and putting mascara on is harder in the bigger mirror. 
So I just use this small one, but like I also, the reason why I have it is because I use it when I'm at school, because like I don't have a mirror at school to like, like I have a hanging mirror, which you guys have seen in like dorm tours, and like also I think you've seen it in my room tour. Um, it was like a dangling mirror, like a dangling, like mirror looking thing. And, um, and it hangs from like a door and it's right now my closet door. And, um, so like I have that, but like when I like do my makeup, like it, sometimes I'll sit on the floor and use like that cause it's dangling. So I can just sit on the floor and do it, my makeup. Other times I'll just like use that makeup mirror and just sit at my desk. So the last thing I'm going to do is I'm going to put on this a little bit, just some lip gloss, and it's from Claire's. Um, I also get some of my, like I get my, some of, not a lot of my makeup, but some of it from Claire's, um, and it's really only just like lip gloss and stuff. Um, everything else is from Walmart, and I mainly just get my earrings from Claire's, but it's just this like light color, and it'll just give like a little bit of a shine to my lips, so like. I look like I'm like interesting and like people are gonna be like why did you freaking put makeup on for this and I'm like listen you guys probably like live like two minutes down the road like five like five minutes ten minutes down the freaking road I seriously live like 20 30 minutes from this place so I have to wake up a lot probably a lot earlier than you guys do. But anyway, so this video was a lot longer than I wanted it to be, but that is, like, okay, like, I talked, I updated you guys, so, yeah, so, thanks for watching this video, it, um, I don't know what I was trying to say, I was gonna tell you guys it'd be up later, um, probably when I get off of work or later tonight, um, but thanks for watching this video, and I will see you guys in my next video.